Are you aware that your body has the remarkable ability to build muscle and repair tissue even while you are asleep? Most people think of muscle growth as something that only happens in the gym, during a workout, when you are lifting weights or doing resistance training. But here is the surprising truth. The majority of actual muscle building happens while you are resting and especially during deep sleep. This is when your body switches into repair mode. Your growth hormone is released in pulses, your tissues knit themselves back together, and your metabolism gets a chance to reset. If you are not getting this repair process right, you might wake up feeling weak, sluggish, or even notice that your muscles are not recovering the way they should, no matter how much effort you put into exercise or nutrition during the day. And here is the fascinating part. Two simple vitamins can act almost like accelerators for this process. They do not replace sleep and they do not replace training, but they make the time you spend sleeping far more productive for your muscles, your metabolism, and even your long-term longevity. In other words, if you wanna wake up stronger, more energized and more metabolically resilient, you need to know how these vitamins work inside your body. Let me explain why this matters. As we age, starting in our 30s and accelerating into our 40s and beyond, we naturally begin to lose muscle mass. This process is called sarcopenia. It is one of the root drivers of fatigue, slower metabolism, weight gain, and even frailty later in life. Muscle is not just about looking toned. It is an organ of longevity. It regulates blood sugar, stores amino acids for healing, supports hormone balance, and even helps control inflammation. Now imagine this. Every night you have a window of opportunity. Your body is either rebuilding itself or it is breaking itself down. The difference between those two outcomes often comes down to whether your cells have the raw materials they need to repair and grow. That is where vitamins come in, not in the abstract, take a multivitamin and hope for the best way, but in a very precise metabolic way that interacts with hormones, mitochondria, and even your nervous system. So here is what we are gonna cover in this video. First, I will break down what really happens in your body during deep sleep that makes it such a critical time for muscle growth. Second, I will reveal the two vitamins that science shows can directly enhance muscle repair while you sleep. Third, I will show you how to get these vitamins naturally from food and when it may make sense to supplement. Fourth, I will share the timing strategies that matter because the when can be just as important as the what. And finally, we will tie it all together into a simple nightly protocol you can follow to wake up stronger. By the end of this talk, you will understand not just the what, but the why behind these nutrients, and you will have practical tools you can apply tonight. So let us dive in. When most people think about muscle growth, they imagine lifting heavy weights, pushing through resistance exercises, or sweating through an intense workout. And yes, training is essential. But here's the truth that often gets overlooked. The gym is where you stimulate muscle, but sleep is where you actually build it. If your sleep is shallow, disrupted, or unsupported by the right nutrients, you are leaving much of your hard work on the table. Here is what is really going on inside your body. When you fall into deep, slow wave sleep, your brain shifts gears and your pituitary gland begins releasing growth hormone in rhythmic pulses. Think of growth hormone like a construction crew that only comes out at night. Its job is to signal your muscle fibers to repair microscopic tears, lay down new protein, and strengthen their connections. This is the biological moment when your workout investments are cashed in. Without this nightly hormone surge, your progress slows dramatically. Now, here's where the analogy helps. Imagine you are renovating a house. You have the blueprints, you have the workers, but if there are no raw materials delivered to the site, no wood, no nails, no cement, the work cannot get done. That is exactly what happens when your body lacks the essential nutrients needed for repair. Growth hormone may be shouting instructions, but if your cells do not have the right building blocks, the construction project stalls. One of the biggest building blocks your body needs at night is amino acids from protein, but equally critical are the vitamins and minerals that act like the spark plugs of metabolism. They do not provide the bulk material, but without them, the machinery does not turn on. And this is where many people get stuck. 
They eat protein during the day, they exercise, but they neglect the micronutrients that actually allow those proteins to be converted into new functional muscle. Another layer to understand is cortisol, your stress hormone. Cortisol should naturally dip at night, giving space for growth hormone to rise. But for many people, modern life has disrupted this cycle. If you go to bed stressed, wired from screens, or running on caffeine, your cortisol stays elevated. Elevated cortisol at night is like having the construction crew trying to build while a demolition team is tearing things down. This tug of war leaves you waking up tired, inflamed, and with slower recovery. So, the real secret is not just sleep quantity, but sleep quality and giving your body the nutrients it needs to make the most of that repair window. Studies consistently show that individuals who sleep less than seven hours not only gain more fat, but also lose lean muscle over time, even if their diet and exercise are the same. In fact, a controlled study published in the Annals of Internal Medicine found that when sleep was restricted, participants lost more muscle and less fat compared to when they had adequate rest. This highlights how powerful the sleep muscle connection truly is. Now, here is the encouraging part. This process is not outside your control. You can influence it tonight by creating an evening environment that lowers cortisol, supports growth hormone release, and supplies your body with the exact vitamins it needs. You can transform sleep from passive downtime into active recovery time. That is where the two vitamins we are focusing on come in because they set the stage for your muscles to repair efficiently, your metabolism to reset, and your energy to be higher the next morning. If this is helpful so far, consider subscribing. I post content like this every day, focused on giving you the tools to master your metabolism naturally. So now that we understand why sleep is the true engine of muscle growth, let us explore the first key vitamin, vitamin D, and why it behaves less like a nutrient and more like a hormone that shapes your strength while you sleep. When you hear the word vitamin D, you might immediately think of bones and sunlight. And that is true. Vitamin D is crucial for bone density. But what the research now makes clear is that vitamin D acts more like a hormone than a vitamin. And one of its key roles is directly tied to muscle health and recovery. Here is what is really going on inside your body. Vitamin D binds to receptors that are found inside your muscle cells. Think of these receptors as ignition switches. When vitamin D connects, it flips the switch on genes that control protein synthesis, muscle contraction, and even mitochondrial energy production. Without enough vitamin D, those switches stay dimmed and your body struggles to fully repair and grow muscle fibers. Now, let me explain this with a simple analogy. Imagine your muscles are like a factory. Protein is the raw material, growth hormone is the manager shouting orders, but vitamin D is the electricity that powers the factory machinery. Without electricity, the factory may have workers and materials, but nothing moves. That is exactly why so many people who are deficient in vitamin D feel weak, sluggish, and unable to build strength despite working out or eating protein. What the research shows is compelling. Low vitamin D levels are strongly linked with reduced muscle strength, slower recovery, and higher risk of falls as we age. A study published in the Journal of Clinical Endocrinology and Metabolism found that older adults with sufficient vitamin D levels had significantly greater muscle strength and function than those who were deficient. Another study in the Journal of Bone and Mineral Research showed that vitamin D supplementation improved muscle performance and reduced risk of sarcopenia in adults over the age of 50. But here's the key detail most people miss nighttime is when vitamin D's muscle supporting effects become most important. Why? Because this is when your body is in its peak state of protein turnover. Your muscle cells are literally repairing the micro tears created during exercise and vitamin D is needed to activate the genetic machinery that turns amino acids into new muscle tissue. If you are low in vitamin D, you are missing that signal when you need it most. So, how do you make sure you are getting enough? Sunlight is still the most powerful and natural source. Just 15 to 30 minutes of midday sun on your skin can boost your vitamin D significantly depending on your skin type and location. But here is the challenge. 
Many people today spend most of their time indoors, use sunscreen daily, or live in regions where the sun angle is too low during the fall and winter months to generate vitamin D at all. That is why deficiency is so widespread, even in countries with abundant sunlight. From a food perspective, vitamin D is naturally found in fatty fish like salmon, sardines, and mackerel, as well as in egg yolks and liver. However, the amounts are relatively small compared to what your body may require, especially if your blood levels are already low. This is where supplementation can play a role. For most adults, a daily intake between 1,000 and 2,000 international units is a safe starting point, though testing your blood levels is the most precise way to guide dosing. Here's a practical tip. If you do supplement with vitamin D, take it in the evening with a meal that contains some healthy fat, like avocado, olive oil, or nuts. Vitamin D is fat soluble, meaning it is absorbed far better when paired with dietary fat. And by taking it later in the day, you are aligning its peak availability with your nighttime repair window. So, to summarize, vitamin D is not just for bones. It acts as a hormone that powers the muscle repair factory while you sleep. Without it, your growth hormone signals and protein intake cannot reach their full potential. With it, you create the conditions to wake up stronger, more resilient, and better protected against age-related muscle loss. Next, let us talk about magnesium, the mineral that calms your nervous system, relaxes your muscles, and allows your recovery to unfold without interference. If vitamin D is the ignition switch for muscle repair, then magnesium is the steady hand on the dimmer switch, creating the perfect environment for that repair to actually happen. Without magnesium, your body struggles to relax, your nervous system stays overstimulated, and your muscles cannot fully recover during sleep. Here is what is really going on inside your body. Magnesium is required in more than 300 biochemical reactions, many of them tied directly to energy production and muscle function. Inside your muscle cells, magnesium sits at the core of adenosine triphosphate, your body's main energy currency. In fact, adenosine triphosphate is only biologically active when bound to magnesium. That means without enough magnesium, your cells cannot generate the energy needed to fuel repair. But magnesium's role goes beyond energy. It is also the mineral that allows your muscles to truly relax. Every time a muscle fiber contracts, calcium floods in to trigger the movement for that muscle to release. Magnesium must push the calcium back out. If calcium is the accelerator, magnesium is the brake pedal. Without enough of it, your muscles stay in a semi-contracted state, leading to cramps, tightness, or that restless feeling that can interfere with sleep. Let me give you a simple analogy. Imagine trying to sleep in a room with the lights on and the radio blaring. That is what your nervous system feels like when magnesium is low. Overstimulated, restless, and unable to transition into deep recovery. When magnesium is sufficient, it is like turning off the lights, lowering the volume, and allowing your brain and muscles to drift into the deep, restorative stages of sleep. What the research shows is that magnesium supplementation improves both sleep quality and muscle recovery. A clinical trial published in the Journal of Research in Medical Sciences found that adults who supplemented with magnesium experienced significantly better sleep efficiency, longer sleep time, and reduced nighttime cortisol. Another study in nutrients showed that athletes with higher magnesium intake had less inflammation and faster muscle recovery after intense exercise. Here is where it gets practical. Magnesium is found in many plant-based foods, but most people fall short of the recommended daily intake. Leafy greens like spinach and Swiss chard, seeds like pumpkin and sunflower, nuts such as almonds and cashews, and even dark chocolate are rich sources. However, soil depletion and modern food processing have lowered magnesium levels in our food supply, making deficiency far more common than most realize. If you are looking to supplement, forms like magnesium glycinate or magnesium citrate are often better absorbed and gentler on the stomach than magnesium oxide. A typical range for supplementation is 200 to 400 milligrams per evening, though starting low and increasing as tolerated is a good approach. Taking magnesium in the evening has an additional advantage. It naturally supports 
melatonin production and calms the nervous system, setting you up for deeper sleep. Here is a practical nighttime protocol. About one to two hours before bed, have a light snack that includes magnesium rich foods, for example, a small handful of almonds or a few squares of dark chocolate with a calming herbal tea. If supplementing, take your magnesium at the same time. Pair this with a short wind down routine. Dim the lights, shut off screens, and allow your cortisol to drop. This creates the ideal environment for vitamin D and growth hormone to do their repair work while you sleep. If this is helpful so far, consider subscribing. I post content like this every day to help you understand and optimize your metabolism naturally. So, to recap, magnesium fuels cellular energy, relaxes your muscles, lowers nighttime cortisol, and sets the stage for repair. Without it, you may find yourself restless, cramping, or waking up unrefreshed, even after a full night's sleep. With it, you allow your muscles and nervous system to align with your body's natural recovery rhythms. Next, let us explore how magnesium and vitamin D work together, and why ignoring their partnership is one of the most common mistakes people make when trying to wake up stronger. We have talked about vitamin D as the ignition switch and magnesium as the calm, steady hand that sets the environment for repair. But here's a piece that often gets overlooked. These two nutrients do not work in isolation. They actually depend on each other. Without magnesium, your body cannot fully activate or utilize vitamin D. And without vitamin D, magnesium's benefits for muscle repair are incomplete. Their relationship is a perfect example of how nutrients function as a team rather than solo players. Here